Hello, Knowledge and Quest fans. My name is Kevin Grant, famous author of the hit series Knowledge and Quest. Um, basically, I just want to do a continuation of the other video that was produced um, with the kids and I. So today, I just want to talk a little bit more about myself and why I decided to create Nellis and Aaron Quest. Um, basically, Nellis and Aaron Quest is composed of the main character, Nellis the Peacock. Um, Nellis the Peacock is considered prey by most predators. And what I wanted to do was I wanted to focus on the life of Nellis the Peacock. Now, as you can see, most predators, what they want to do is actually attack the prey and dominate them. Now, Nellis, on the other hand, is born of a different mold. Nellis has self-confidence, and what he wants to do is he wants to utilize his gift against those predators by standing up for what's right and trying to protect other prey like himself. So Nellish is a relatable character and we can relate our life in his perspective. Now Nellish, um, the traits that make him who he is, Nellish is very clever and what he normally do is he use those abilities to get himself out of those dire situations against predators. So he's witty, He's cocky, he's smart, again, he's clever, and he, he has these natural defensive abilities. Now, I don't want to share those abilities with you just yet because I want you to dive into the book to see what those abilities are about. But along with knowledge, um, everyone has a sidekick, every superhero. So, Dominic the Flamingo. Um, Dominic the Flamingo, he's very smart, very intelligent, and Dominic, he's more the handyman. So what he normally do is he use his genius abilities to make gadgets that assist Nellis in battle. So along with Dominic the Flamingo, we have Ruby the Sarah's Crane. Um, she's the black and white bird that's um, sitting next to me over here. Um, hence the name Ruby. Now she's composed of red along with her face. But I also wanted to create someone with some spunk and a fiery attitude. So Ruby the Cyrus Crane fits that mold. She's very aggressive. Um, she has um, some of those traits to try to repel against those characters. So Ruby the Cyrus the Cyrus Crane is born. Now that's some of the 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 good guys in the book, but also with the good there's also the bad. So I came up with um, some villains that can be relatable in the Nellis Marion Quest universe. Um, villain number one, um, we have Tigris Natalia, or Lady Tigris Natalia. The fact that in the animal kingdom, um, tigers are um, one of the chief predators so I wanted Tigris Natalia to represent that role. And some of the characteristics that she has is the fact that she's very sultry. And what I mean by sultry is Tigris Natalia um, uses her looks and her dominance to get what she wants. Um, if she don't have things her way, she, were, she will conquer by any means. So um, she used that to her advantage. And I also wanted to include Parag the Panther. The fact that um, he's considered a predator is the fact that he used his dominance to prey against the weakened, the defenseless. So um, Parag, he's mentioned throughout the earlier series of the book because I wanted to build a canon uh, based on hierarchy. So Parag is kind of like, um, a step under um, Tigris Natalia, but um, we do have like different facets of hierarchy. So he's mentioned kind of like an earlier series of the book. Now those are some of the predators and some of the prey. And again, what I wanted to do is make relatable characters. 
So we all been bullying our life. And what I wanted to do was paint a pretty good picture in regards to some of the things that we face. I'm no different, you know, I've been bullied um, for being smart, I've been bullied for just being different. So um, during those times, I wish I could have a superhero of some sort to just rescue me. And that's why I wanted to create Nellis the Peacock as some sort of hero that anybody that's stuck in that situation can use. And I wanted to relate it not only to kids, but to adults too. So um, we all face different facets of our lives. And I just wanted to, I feel that I'm here. I was born for this purpose, just to um, paint a good picture and to provide quality entertainment through the form of uh, the Nellis Man Quest series. And I'm not just content with just making the books. What I want to do is I want to actually show up to your home, show up to your school, in a form of entertainment, like through the um, TV lens. And not only through TV, um, my plan is to actually, you know, just go out to public venues, like different schools, um, different fairs, um, you know, different events in the community, because I want to actually um, just provide the entertainment. And I just want to thank my team that actually um, helped produce vivid um, imagination to life. And um, I don't want to just limit it there. We do have a website that tells more about the characters. And we also um, have more characters that's going to be made. This is some of the characters. We have much more to come. But we would like you to visit our website at NellishQuest.com. And that's spelled N-E-L-I-S-H-Q-U-E-S-T dot com. Again, that's N-E-L-I-S-H-Q-U-E-S-T dot com. On the website, we have a page that actually talks about the author. We actually have a page that talks more about the characters. And we also have a shopping page that has a series of original art that I created and also we have these prototypes here because what we want to do is we want to actually have a mass production of characters actually produced so that way we can provide it to the hearts of kids and adults alike. Uh, we would like for you guys to actually have everything in hand. And not only that, we also have our books. Uh, book one is actually available through our Amazon website not only that, we want to actually have our books available through other mass means. Um, book two, Knowledge Nair and Quest Predator Uprising, is going to be released soon, and that's actually on our website as well, but we'll let you know exactly when book two is being launched. And not only book two, we also have a list of future books that's going to be portrayed. But for now, book one is available, and book two will be available soon. But other than that, we just want to thank you for being a part of the Knowledge Dan Quest series. Our purpose is to provide quality entertainment, and that's by sharing my gift to the world. So thank you for your time, and tune in to the website. Thanks.